And welcome to the Guardians of the Galaxy. And probably we are listening to Star Wars. Oh, yes. This thing the world. Probably will be quiet, so you won't hear it. Hey, birthday boy! I wonder you can hear me. Is that your new tape? Star Lord? Who's the guy with the scary eyes? He doesn't have a name. He's one of the space riders. And he's not scary. He's cool. Your space rider certainly got his hands full. Pretty far out! Nobody says far out anymore, Ma. <laughs> Ma! What? Nobody says far out anymore. Oh, well, your mom does. Maybe we should see if we could get tickets to see them live. Really? Mm -hmm. Your mom may not look it, but I was quite the rocker when I was your age. Your father and I would just lie on the hood of my old Chevy and listen to Black Sabbath and... You like Black Sabbath? Like I said, your mom's cooler than you think. Oh, we'd look up at the stars and he'd tell me all about the places he'd been... Mom? How about some cake, huh? Yeah, I'll be up in a sec. You said that 15 minutes ago. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. <laughs> you wouldn't. Yes, I would. Hey, watch the hair. <laughs> Why are your eyes Ow. so red? Peter! We've talked about you leaving your toys on the floor. It's not a toy. It's an action figure. More like an action landmine. Stab your foot. I will. He doesn't even... Never mind. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec. I promise. Right. Get, up. Get out of the bed. Come on. We still got the full moon to explore. Oh man, I can't wait to play this. Maybe I can convince Annie to buy it with his paper out money. Okay. This will be worth hundreds of dollars someday. Hmm. Maybe, maybe. I don't know if we get to make it easy. I gotta beat Janie's high score. This is embarrassing. What? Anything? Three natural ones in a row last game? Some bard I turned out to be. I feel you. Mm. It's pretty crazy that all that destruction started from one little mistake. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Mm. Need to build up my calluses. Mm. 
keep hitting those dingers, George. And he'll make it in the Hall of Fame for sure. Those things are worth a fortune in 20 years. Fingers are still crap from trying to bookmark pages. I know that's not how you're supposed to play, but I'm tired of dying everywhere. I know that one. I really do. <laughs> Might as well just peel the stickers off and put them in the right spot. Might as well. I think that concludes our room. So let's get out. On the perfect note as well. What the hell? Stop doing this, man. It's weird. We are approaching the quarantine zone. How long was I out for? 15,338 ticks. That's very specific. The betrayer is ready to begin our mission. She has requested your presence in the cockpit. Gamora's on our side, Drax. She is the spawn of my sworn enemy, a murderess and a traitor. I do not trust her. We'll try. We're supposed to be a team. Us on spot. <gasps> Out here on the frontier, cops don't have time to arrest people. <laughs> Relax, bud. Novacore ain't the type to shoot first. Arresting folks is their whole thing. That and silly helmets. <gasps> Gamora? Up here, Peter. Hey, that's my chair. Oh, then why aren't you in it? I was, uh, Airplane. strategizing. It's one thing to get into the zone, but we still gotta catch that monster. Right. So did I miss anything? Other than a ton of suspicious glares from Drax, not really. Now, if you're done strategizing, feel free to grab your seat. We're almost ready to go. Once we breach that force field, there's no going back. Your black market codes are gonna crack that Nova net, right? Yep. As soon as you enter them in your console. Okay. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Rocket Groot Drax, get in here. We're going in. We still have a few ticks before the next time window, actually. The next one? Nova Corps security guard resets every rotation. We want to be in and out before our code expires, or we'll get stranded. You 
We wait for the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Novanet still up? Thought we were going in. Well, it appears the Assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the Betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor coats are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. Zero four five one. Oh. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacore. It's not that simple. The code only works on this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. There. Exactly, do and we're in. Incredible. I never realized there was so much stuff left after the war. Restraint wasn't very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Yeah, it's probably all harmless now. I mean, Novacor had 12 years to get rid of the heavy duty explosives, right? <laughs> That's why I like you, Quill. You're so pure. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this tech. Stay focused, Rodent. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overall. Plus, there's good money in it. The piece that we seek is far more valuable to the Monster Queen of Seknoff 9 than any illegally acquired salvage. Whoa! Oh, place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster, but that big cylinder up ahead looks like the mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. <clears throat> friend? For a night? And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Groot, Quell, suit up. Team Rocket's up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the assassin. Oh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it. My skin is not green. It's teal. Teal? What? Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks to the drop site. Ground's too unstable to land the ship, so you'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, Groot. <laughs> Don't worry! Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle, and we'll capture the monster. Together. Very well. What could possibly go wrong, eh? Thumper one, done. Mora, take care of my baby. It's a ship, Peter, not a child. Oh, oh. can you imagine? Are you good? What, the pink goo? It's custom nano resin, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you, we can walk. I'm thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yeah, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that spanned the entire galaxy held together by pink goo. Ebrium based nano resin. Whatever. I'm just saying, it's a lot to take in. You know, I think I do sort of get it. Thousands of worlds fighting for some fleeting greater good. Guess it is kind of poetic. I am good. Ah, cheer up. Just because the war was horrible doesn't mean there wasn't good times along the way. I am good. Yeah, I am mostly talking about stuff blowing up. Double press. Oh. Okay. How many of these ships did you personally destroy, Assassin? In this massive junkyard, filled with debris from both sides of the war. How do you expect me to answer that? Honestly. I did press it. Oh. Mm. Okay, so I'll 
makes a difference. Is that horns? Okay, okay. You know, and... I like this. This is fun. The three of us hanging out, just like when we started this gig, before you know who joined us. I am Quill. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Quill's a, a swell guy. <laughs> The three of us have had some good times. Remember the gig on Draconius? <sighs> the locals did not appreciate us hauling them onto our ship. Lark and shapeshifters, man. Careful on that thing, Quill. You spot <laughs> something out there? I am careful. I saw something. There's the mining rig. Any sign Listen. of our monster? Not yet. Don't worry, it's safe to walk on, mostly. That's why green team's on the Milano. Heck of a lot more dangerous to fly around in here. I heard that. Whoa! Pretty sure that way's a dead end. Uh, you sure? Ah, there we go. Path's this way. Come on. How can you even tell? Just trust me, all right? Hey, okay. rule. You think we could find pieces of the Tryon Shard in here? I'm good. You never heard of the Tryon Shard? Pyramid of pure evil that corrupts everything it comes in contact with. How'd you even know the other way was a dead end? Because, unlike you, I have a very keen sense of direction. He doesn't. Whoop! That was it. Guys, this junk isn't as stable as we think. Take that, brittle stuff. Hmm. Come on, it's safe to pass. Really? <laughs> Gross. <laughs> nice splatter. Hey, 50 units says I can clear more of these suckers than you. As if. You want a bet? Whoa, what the? Rocket, did you do that? The scoreboard? You like it? Hacked it into your visor cover last time you took a snooze. You hacked into my stuff? I appreciate it. Considering how many times I fixed the flarkin thing, it might as well be my stuff. Optimal thumper placing distance should be just up ahead. I'm good. I'm thinking right in front, through the giant hole where this ship's cockpit used to be. Ah! Amazing! Oh. I should have been recording. Bridge over. I want to see if he's alive. I am good. I don't know, but he's twitching. Flarkin, Scott Stain, Quill. You okay down there? Yep. Yeah, just, uh... Thought I saw a shortcut. shortcut. Right. Go ahead without me. I'll catch up. Okay. There's a crapped out Nova Corps missile bay just on the other side. We'll meet you there. Yellow and blue missile bay. Got it. Okay. Crawling through creepy old ship. No big deal. Easy there, Quill. Pretty sure nothing's gonna jump out at you. Except maybe me and crew. Oh, I think I'm in this place. I'm gonna go sweet. Nope. How's Team Rocket doing down there? We're fine. Waiting for Quill to go on the floor. Trying to bring the whole place down, Quill. I shot a thing. I get it. First tool in the old toolbox. Yes. <clears throat> Ooh, don't die, don't die, don't die. Oh, hey, little guy. Ah! Mm, okay. Oh. Whoa, what the floor? You dead, Quill? We can hear your wussy squeal even without the car. Little busy. Oh. It's like popping a zit! Crap! That's cheating! You guys should have seen that. Him. It was this weird nope. lobby thing. Let's see Not falling for this again. 
Oh, so they spawn from these, and I want to do them better. Sorry to burst your bubble. Nope. Yo, well, all right. Nope. I'm far from all right. Not funny. Yeah, not funny. Oh, there. Hey, Drax. What makes you so sure this Hell Lady is gonna buy our monster? Her name is Lady Hellbender. Her collection of rare creatures is outdone only by the wealth she showers on those who procure them. Uh, Quill, we got a lot riding on your gal pal's mystery monster tip. I hope she's legit. <laughs> Like you could even tell if she had an honest face. <laughs> yeah, she did smell like that. Trust in the plan, guys. Everything is checked out so far, right down to the mining ship. We put our thumpers in the right places, and we'll bag that monster. Uh, Quill knows all about putting thumpers in the right places. <laughs> and getting oh. monsters in the sack, too. <laughs> Mother of Scott! Are you kidding me? Son of a smack! That was too close! You okay, Groot? Well, we're fine, but we can't jump that. You don't gotta jump. There's a sturdy support beam on this side. Get Groot to grow a bridge across. Just ask him nice like. He does it for me all the time. Mm -hmm. This what you? No. Whoa. Hold. Oh, okay. All right, Groot. Let's see that cool vine. <laughs> That's one hell of a party trick, big guy. Gross! More Seems ship stuff. eaters! Ah, oh, they're everywhere! No, we're not gonna kill them. Alright! Back to business! Boom! Right under your nose, Quill! So, am I supposed to ask him again? He's out. We gotta go that way, across the gap, somehow. Groot, I found a hitch. Can you latch onto it? I'm Groot. Hey, Greenies, mm -hmm. you see any blue and gold ships out there? You let us know. We have seen many such ships. He means active ones. We haven't talked about what to do if we run into a Nova Corps patrol. Uh, we'll restrain them until you're done here. Bad idea. Those cops are all connected through their stupid helmets. If they do spot us, all they have to do is close that barrier and we're stuck in here with the rest of the graveyard. If you see cops, you get my ship out of here. Even if it means leaving us behind. Uh, flark that! Trust me. Okay, here we go. All right, set her down right there. Yep, one to go. Flark! No, no, Flark and Skaggs, attack and batteries fry. That's what's wrong. Maybe you put it down too hard. Let's just find a solution. The solution's a new battery with a charge. Okay, we're on what's left of a ship, full of ship things. Got to be things that power ship things around here, right? Yeah. Maybe you're gonna want to use your visor for this. You find a replacement while I finish scraping the fried wires. Mm. <laughs> hey! A huge power generator! How do we hook it up? We don't! That thing would toast our little thumper. 
Can't we condense the power through a routing funnel or something? Don't try to make up tech stuff. It's irritating. Find something else. Um, those? There, the battery. Charged. All um. this firepower. Now it's all just scrap. I am Groot. Yeah. Sorry, bud. Sorry about what? Groot's people never even got a chance to fight. Old Destin planet was torched at the start of the war. So much for that. So maybe it's more up there. So, Drax, how come you're so in love with this Hellbender lady? I do not love Lady Hellbender. Yeah, we could be all like her name. Don't you cannot bend hell. That does not at all resemble me. <laughs> Found something with a charge. Kind of looks like a spacey car battery. Okay, this thing isn't gonna zap me, right? The chance is minuscule. At well, best, you'll be fine. There you go. What are you waiting for, Quill? Grab it. Here you go. That'll do nicely. Just let me tinker a bit. I'll have to do some tweaking once I see how much juice this thing puts out. So, uh, watch my back. Watch it from what? Of course. Rocket! Help me scramble some critters! No, 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 Scott! If I don't rewire this fast, it's gonna short circuit! Root is a vigorous defender, able to withstand high amounts of damage. He is on crowd control. He's basically the entangle. Immobilize and some speed or yeah, for a short amount of time. Okay, we can get one last freaky eye thing! Marcus <laughs> killing party favor! I was thinking to do that though. Whoa. There's a lot of real bad, buddy! If I don't fix this thing, they'll keep coming! Then you only fix him. Easy for you to say. You've got a pointy stick. Why is that one purple? Thanks for the heads up, bud. Why they are all purple and what? What the? Use that bear! Kill them all! Okay, Just no, I don't like it. Lights out, eyeballs! Turn this killing party, baby! Bringing the pain! Branch out, crew! Keep him away from that Ooh, missile, Groot! Is the rodent procuring further armaments? Bye-bye, little guy! None. We're all plugged in. Wow. Just in time. I'd like to see you fix it next time. Come on. Two down, two to go. Hard Groot. Groot's wondering if the reward's gonna be worth all the risk we're taking for this job. Nope. Me and Groot are nearly unkillable, but what if the rest of you don't make it out alive? If the two of us gotta lug that monster- Guys, we deliver this monster to Lady Hellbender, we'll get bigger payouts, and jobs that don't suck. A ship for each one of us! I mean, a team only needs one ship. Perhaps a more spacious ship. What? No! I love my baby! We can modify her, I'd kill for a gunner's rotunda. We'll think about it. I'm Groot. Groot wants a plant. Groot, man, we will get you two plants. Man, that thing is ridiculous. I think it was a ship or a robot. That's a Cree Sentry, a robot, but it would have been space worth. I'm Groot. <laughs> that ain't even the biggest one. They designed at least five experimental models twice that size. Plus half a dozen mega centric prototypes. How do you know all this? Because they were my fellow experiments back on Half World. Most of my parts came from the cybernetics hangar next to the door, so uh, I got a sneak peek at all the new killbots. I could see the parts come and go from my uh, 
Uh, my cage. I didn't mean to open old wounds. Eh, most of them are just scars now anyways. I wasn't even a person to the worst of the Kree's mad scientists. Ooh. More like a real smart walking gun. Very talkative gun. <laughs> yeah, that part was an accident. They tried to fix it a few times. I am Groot. Groot, need you to shoot a bridge right into that socket. I am Groot. Now, I want to see you do that to something in combat. Wait, what is that? Yes! I'm about to win this back quilt! Really? Here goes nothing! <laughs> We're inside a giant robot head! And I got robot parts inside my head! Got robot parts inside your head. Inside a giant robot head! Bam! <laughs> hey, Groot, what do you think I should do when I win this bet? I mean, with the unit still owe me once I win. Where the hell is he? Found a nest! Maybe this is the Parasite Clubhouse! Did you make it? Nope. Don't think I have any other choice. Try to get the... I beat Quill. You know what, Quill? Ooh. I think it's unfair. You got two guns, I got one. I think my points should count double from now on. That's cheating. All right, Thumper goes there, Quill. Uh, get up. And please make it work. It's not gonna piss off every critter around, right? Sorry, Quill. Not taking no chances after the last one. I gotta test it real quick. Not again. <laughs> 